Hello everybody, how are y'all doing? So I made uh, Max Mayfield from Stranger Things in The Sims and it was quite a difficult task, I will not lie. I felt like I just kept getting something wrong with her face. Like I still feel like the final product, something still, still feels like super off. It kind of kind of makes me want to redo it but like it's the best we got i was just playing around with it for a while and then you know we, we get what we get okay um i don't really make like in person not in person real people <laughs> in the sims so it's like uh i don't know if i'm doing this right or if it looks good it's kind of like a throw it up in the air and then we see what happens i mean this is like the second real person i've ever made so uh don't be super critical because i am not a professional at all in this this is not my craft <laughs> but i think it turned she turned out pretty like you can tell like you can tell who i tried to make um with the vibe with the hair and the clothes oh my god don't get me started on the hair i went into like fully and capture her vibe and i feel like a lot of that comes from her hair because her hair is so so pretty like she oh gosh she has the most stunning hair in that entire show like the red and the curls it's gorgeous so i really tried to make sure i like hit the ball on that one it needed to happen it needed to be right so i kept going like in and out of the game to find cc that you know was right for her I'm not really sure how strong the hype for Stranger Things is right now. I mean, I just finished the show, so it took me a minute. Um, I just had to watch the new season, like the part two or whatever. Um, and that took me forever because those episodes were painfully long. And the one was like really painfully boring. So I just kept exiting it and then, you know, scrolling on like Twitter or something. So it's like literally had no motivation to watch i just didn't like it it just wasn't very good i can appreciate the craft and i can you know i understand that it's hard to make a show especially probably a lot of pressure to the writers because it's a big big show and um a lot of people were watching but like come on <laughs> you can do better that was the best you could do so it was like i was a little disappointed but max was definitely my favorite character i loved her dynamic with lucas and l just so sweet um i just man no i don't want to spoil but i'm gonna do a little spoiler here so if you haven't finished the second half don't listen to this but her oh my god her like death and then revival is so dumb like i get like we had to do it to show that l had revival powers but it's just so so stupid <laughs> because l absolutely would have like gained the power to get rid of vecna while max was like before the bones were cracking you know what i mean because they're like besties you know she didn't need mike to be like oh i love you i'm sorry for not telling you sooner i'm so sorry no she didn't need none of that she could have done it without like with her love just for max like oh it bothered me so much because i feel like that's so out of character for her because Elle just really loves her friend so much it should have been enough and that's what bothers me but I get it was to show her revival powers, but I feel like we could have done that some other way. Like, I don't know, maybe someone else died and she was like, okay, and I'm right, I'm bringing you back. Like, I, I don't know. I feel like it just, it just was such a mischaracterization of her and it really, it really bothered me. It did, it did. I'm not even gonna lie. Anyway, enough about the show. <laughs> Let's get back to the sim. So uh, now that I'm looking at her, it's kind of her eyes. Her eyes are too small, right? Like I'm not crazy. I mean, oh man, I should pull up a picture of Sadie and compare right now while I have my, you know, clear mindset to where I'm not making this in because, like, something's off, right? I don't know. Hmm. Strange, strange, strange. But I had a lot of fun picking on her outfit because I needed something kind of raggedy, something, you know, because, you know, she's fighting. She's fighting monsters and stuff. I think I went off a very specific outfit in the show. I think it's the one where she has a jacket. Well, yeah. I mean, I think so because I put my sim in a jacket. But I do think it's one where she was, like, wearing a jacket. So I've tried very hard to have an outfit that, you know, had a jacket. And then just a nice pair of jeans. Something something that's a staple with her. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. I was really researching the outfit, though. I'm not going to lie. 
I made this video a little bit ago, so uh, memory's not fully there, but you know, we, we think we, we are learning as we go. I'm watching the video with you guys. It's like we're on a journey together. I think I'm gonna go back and change the face in just a second. So uh, yeah, I, I think I'm gonna fix the eyes because that's really bothering me. So I'm really hoping I fix the eyes. Uh, but um, see the hair on the Sim is so pretty. I never make redheads in the Sims just because like, I, I actually have no idea why. It's such a pretty hair color. I need to do it more often. I have like, I've made like one or two redhead sims ever. They, you just don't see them in my game ever. There's never one just walking around. I do need to, I do need to make more because it is such a pretty hair color, especially in the sims. Anyway guys, who is so excited for the high school pack? I don't know if it's out actually. I haven't played the sims in a minute or watched a video because uh, during expansion packs release, I just kind of avoid any videos because I don't want any spoilers. That's spoilers. I want to do it myself and I'm waiting till it's on sale. So, I'm not going to be watching any Sims videos for, like, a couple months, probably. It's going to be a shame. I'm going to go through Little Simsy withdrawal, but I will watch her other streams. I actually need to check after this if it's out for the public yet, because I have no clue. I'm so behind on my Sims news. Um, <laughs> I saw people doing, like, early release videos for it, so I don't know. Maybe I'll just buy it full price, because it just sounds so fun and it's that's everything i need i need a high school pack i'm just so 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 excited i was gonna do a like my expectations for the pack video i had like a script halfway written and everything and then i just never finished it which is kind of a shame because the script was kind of good <laughs> um and i made like a slide like i had a slideshow ready like i was ready i just didn't record it because i'm an idiot and i'm dumb but it's okay um we don't need to know my expectations my expectations were high so i hope they hit that mark because i am gonna be sad if they don't i don't know maybe i should watch a review of it then in case i don't want to buy it full price i don't know see that's my thing do i buy it full price and have a complete my own opinion on it and have no spoilers or do i wait till it's on sale and then have no spoilers and just never watch some content or do like what do i do I don't know it's a dilemma i know <laughs> anyway we are nearing the end and you know i can see your ace are down made some changes did all that jazz i'm gonna cut it off here don't forget to like comment subscribe i'll see you guys in the next one